getting an error one. What's that? I wonder if I actually have a replacement. I'm going to take a look here quickly. There we go. So I do have a replacement, but it looks like I'm going to have to do some work on it to do it up properly. I've never done that. So I'm going to leave that for another time. I'm not sure what some of these parts are actually, to be honest. So, well, that one's for my heating element for my hot air. But, uh, I don't even know what this is for. Would anyone know what this is? The thing is with these things, they don't come with instructions, and sometimes you just don't know what it is. Anyways... Um, not sure what that is either. What's this? Anyone know what this guy is? Let me know. I'm not too sure which, what that would be used for on my soldering station, so. Where? Alright, well I'm going to try putting this back together, see if I can't get it to work long enough to uh, tin these. Get this done. Okay, so I think I got it going enough. I don't know what's going on there. Hopefully uh, it maintains until I can get this. Trying to work quickly here. That's it's not bad. I've had this soldering iron for uh, oh boy, quite a few years now. So I've been uh, quite impressed with it for uh, for this part. So. Okay, that ain't going nowhere, so I'm just gonna just gonna touch it with the soldering iron, just so uh, I'm just gonna touch it with the soldering iron, so that way the little bit of wire I have here is actually making good contact with the connector, and then I will get the other end soldered into the other one, and we should be good to go. with that let that cool down for a moment if you haven't seen my little animation on the on the uh, helping hands there uh, check out um, the Instagram page there and uh, you'll see a little fun clip I did with some stop animation on that which was fun okay a touch here make sure nothing's touching on the sides bam there we go 
I'll just nip it off. Good there, we got nothing bridged, so I'm gonna go ahead and turn off my soldering iron. And then I'll put my 10 amp fuse in. I need to open it up again this will be just above the battery and I'll be able to get that on so I'm just gonna go ahead and plug this back on this guy like so okay right on now I have that all done up and ready to go back onto the battery afterwards. What I need to do is get the uh, switches all back together and the panel back in and then I think what I'm going to do is try to find the spring got these guys here. I seem to have lost one of the springs here when I was moving it around. So one doesn't have one, one has one. So let's find out where that went. Now that I got the main board back in, and it looked like maybe I wasn't missing a spring, it looked like just the way that those uh, switches on the other side, how they act. So moving on to the next part, we're going to get this bad boy here back into place. So what I did when I took it out is I left one screw in. I left one screw in so that way I knew the orientation for it to go back in. You don't have to do this, but it's always good to know which way is up. So I'm going to go ahead and slide that guy back in there and button her up. And then... I'll start getting all the wires reconnected and uh, hopefully here in the next little bit we'll be able to test out to see if we are good to go. Before I go any further I'm just going to double check to make sure that the fuse is doing its job. Perfect. So that works. We're good to go there. And it really wasn't hard to tell that the uh, other fuse had blown. It was blown. Okay. So now I've gotten all four screws screwed into this guy. So I've got the board back in. I've got this back in. And I'm going to go ahead and screw uh, the cables for that up. And looks like I'm going to have to do some zap strapping at some point, but for right now, we're just going to be putting it together for testing purposes. I do have to pull it apart later again, because I have to swap out that 10 amp fuse with a 15 amp. So, at that time, that's when I'll do all the fine tuning and making everything pretty again. But for now, this is just to get everything kind of back together and working. battery back in 